Okay. All right, moving on to our next story for today. Yes, Inidima Okoje shares struggle with fibroids. Yes, Nigerian actress Inidima Okoje has revealed a personal health battle she has been going through for a while. She shared this on her Instagram page where she put up a video of herself, which she captioned, my journey with fibroids. Hey guys, I know it's been a minute. I want to share something quite personal with you, but I think it's important because this is something that apparently affects 68 in every 10 black women, but no one talks about it. I found out that I had fibroids in uh, 2017. I remember freaking out so much. The first gynecologist I saw said if it wasn't really bothering me, he wouldn't advise, he would advise rather that I leave it alone, but that I had better go and quickly get married. No <laughs> jokes. <laughs> Of the many things she shared, she opened up about having a successful surgery and that she's now healing slowly but surely. She then concluded by writing, To the women out there dealing with fibroids, I know what a lonely road it can be, not to talk of the pain and discomfort and then there are the ignorant congrats on your pregnancy comments to deal with. It's okay, they don't know any better. I want you to know that my DMs are open to you. If you want to ask questions, talk or even just, just rant, I'll respond once I get stronger. Ha! Ah, I mean, yo, shout out for opening up. I think anyone who, because this um, social media space can be very uh, brutal, can be very harsh. So when you open up, despite knowing that people could judge you, people could say one or two things that judge are you uh, on fibroids. Uh, on so maybe she's talking about um, comments when people see you, they're already like, come back to your pregnancy, because there is the bulge you get from that. So that so, is what I would like to talk about. You know yes. how we talked about body shaming mm -hmm. and somebody is becoming fat, yes, and then you're saying to that person, yeah, you're. You don't even know if that person is dealing with yep. a certain condition. I mean, very correct, very very correct. So that's why, like, I, I give her major props for speaking out. Um, we we talk often about how a lot of um, Nigerian women go through stuff. A lot of people go through stuff, but especially Nigerian women with you know childbirth, miscarriage, and all mm -hmm. that. And people don't open up enough until someone comes out, and people are now like, oh, me too. Oh, me too. Me too. And you're like, oh wow, you went through this as well. How come no one spoke? No one left any manual behind. I'm having to deal with this. And on her page, she put it up, and it was nice to see you know her celebrity friends show support. Um, I also saw some people take the opportunity, fans and stuff, take the opportunity to share their story as well and say, oh, I dealt with this at the age of 22. I think Toke I has talked about something like this too. Um, Toke Makewa? Yes. Mm, okay. Yeah. Mm. So, it's just crazy. Now, yeah. now seeing the story, I now, I now remember, I now notice that Inidima is that person that kills every red carpet yes, when can. she comes for any movie premiere. And lately, all the ones they've been doing, I've not seen her. Yeah. So seeing this, I say, oh, okay, no wonder yeah. she was dealing with something. And it's just crazy. And I stumbled on her Instagram page, she going through all of this and doing a magic trick with her um, house help. That one will yes, always get me laughing yeah. every time. But to imagine that she was going through yeah. stuff like this. And man. before this post, she hadn't posted anything yeah. since I think the first week in December. Mm -hmm. So she has been recovering yeah. according to her. Crazy so that's man. great. We're also thankful on her behalf yes, for true. a successful surgery. True. True that, true I mean, that. a lot of people talk about what? stuff in 2020 and yeah. she said, you know, it was rough, but we got through it. So she said the doctor great. that removed the fibroids was the same doctor that conceived her. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yes. yeah. yeah. It was a very lengthy post, yeah, yeah for sure. Man. All right.